Hey everybody, welcome back to Satisfactory. The Manta just uh, rode by. I was hoping to get him for the intro, but I was too slow, but he'll be back. Um, if you're wondering if he clips this tower that we're in, the answer is yes, he does. <laughs> um, I did not realize that when I built it, but it he just barely clips it, so I'm fine with it. Whatever, that's what's happening. Uh, but yeah, we are back at our nuclear power. I guess it's, it will be nuclear power eventually. Right now, it's nuclear fuel production. This will be our nuclear power facility eventually. Um, for that, we are drinking our nuclear daiquiri, which is red instead of green. It's red because I used grenadine instead of the other thing that I can't remember the name of right now. I can't remember what that thing's called. It's on the screen. The F1. <laughs> Uh, cause I don't have any of that. So I have grenadine. That's an alternative. Cheers. I can't believe I forgot what that stuff's called. You have to look up the recipe again. Anyhow, we are up here in the tower. Not my tower of shame. This is just my decoration tower. And we are getting ready to get all this stuff hooked up. So let's get that hooked up, shall we? Uh, first things first. I'm going to need to get copper in here somehow. And I haven't quite figured out the best process for that yet. I think it's going to come in right here. Because copper's there. Yeah, let's do that. So give me one of these. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? That'll be fine. And actually, what we could do... Yeah. We can do this. This is always fun. Which does mean that this door can't be here, because that's super dangerous. Oh, that is not correct either, actually. Health and safety is going to have a field day with that. So let's go like this. Hey, there we go. And uh, we'll bring that belt through here. Now, we need 100 copper per minute. So let's use our Mark II belts. <laughs> right down to the trees. Perfect. Cover. Yep. And okay, good. So this middle one. Oh, this is all backwards. This middle translation is going to be for nuclear waste. That's why it's facing the other direction. Uh, I do not have the nuclear waste set up yet. <laughs> Where it's going to go? Um, I think I'm going to build it kind of near where the uranium mine is. I did, I literally just did the exact same thing. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm going to build it where the uranium mine is. I'm just going to stick a bunch of uh, storage containers in there. In that cave. Okay, copper bars. Yes, good. I will get the power running first before I do that. Set up that nuclear waste, though. I'm not even sure if the um, transition is scheduled for that yet. I'll have to look at that as well. But we are not there yet. Right now, we're dealing with copper. This is the blueprint that does have these connected, which is good. Now, these outputs... 
Oh, this one's actually fine. I'm going to change these a little bit. So what we're going to do, this one's going to split and come this way and this way, and then these are going to be my inputs for these machines. So each machine will have two and a half, 25 per minute, right. And these output 10, exactly, okay. I mathed correctly for a change. So we can do a merger here, going like that. You need to be a splitter. Oh, okay, this can't stay like that. Okay, and you gotta be a merger. Oh, this radiation. I think when you have your suit on, if you're fully protected from the radiation, the Geiger counter shouldn't make noise. It's a little annoying. Or there should be like a mute, an option to mute it. Okay. So that's that. The other thing we need in here are our... Oh, quick wire. Ooh, I forgot about that. Okay, that's easy though. Quick wire builds pretty easily, I think. We need 200, so we need three and a bit machines. Okay. Um, oh, interesting, okay. Well, let's do it. And I did at one point know that quick wire was required because I have quick wire right there. So that's good. So this is 18. We are going to have to increase one of these a little bit. Um, to 80, basically. That's such an awesome feature. <laughs> you can just type the things in there. Oh man. Good times. Okay, cool. So quick wire. It's going to be up a level. Come on, rotate. Yes. Okay, cool. Very nice, very nice. How many ingots do you need per minute? Oh, okay, so that's that's pretty simple. Let's get our quick wire up here. It's right there. Yeah, we'll keep it on the ground floor. That'll be fine. And actually, you don't need a splitter. Okay. Now, how was I going to do this? I think we got to get rid of that. Bring this down like so. Yeah. This is Caterium, correct? Let's just double check. Yes, it is. Okay. Oh no, that is not. That is not good. That is not where you need to go. Oh, there's. There goes the Manta. Ready to clip through the tower again. Oh, we missed them. 
Okay, I gotta remember to run up there when next time I hear him coming. Okay, cool. That is that. Now my next question... Is how are we bringing these staters up? And how are we bringing them into where they gotta go? They gotta go over there. So I think what we're gonna do... Is something like this. Um, if we put the staters on level 2... And then the I, I, the AI limiters can go in on level one. I think that'll work. Confirm AI limiters and staters. Very good. Things are where they gotta be. Actually, you know what? You can have some staters. And you're making AI limiters, right? Nope, you're making AI limiters, right? Yes. Okay, cool. Everything's coming together. And this is one to one, I believe. Four per minute. Oh no, because you're slugged out. Yeah, okay. So we do have to merge these belts. Okay, that's fine. Let's deal with staters first. This might not line up quite as nicely as I was hoping. Oh, nope, that lines up perfectly. Never mind. So you can just face this way. Yeah. Are you gonna make it? You are. Man, this is coming together so nicely. <laughs> oh, I think I earned myself this awkward drink. A sip of this not super hot beverage. Okay. So let's do a splitter. Perfect. Oh no. What? What? Is this not right? No, it's not right. How did that happen? Oh, I know exactly how it happened. Don't answer that. The answer is I am bad at directions. Okay, yeah, there we go. So, let's just double check. 10 AI limiters. Um, so that's 4, you are 6. And 15 staters. Yep. And I believe we're making 18. So we're going to have a couple extra, which is fine. Any staters? Oh, wow. 16 staters. Okay, so we have like one extra. So I said 15, right? Yeah. Very good. And everything. You are short of quick wire. 100 per minute. What is happening here? What's wrong? Are you not tier 3? No, you are. Oh, you are not. Okay, there we go. You're probably not either. Yeah, alright. Very good. Quick wire. We need 200. Oh, Miranda! No! 
<laughs> yeah, he, he kind of clips through. Or she. Or it. Or they. You don't have Caterium. Are we that hurting for Caterium? We're only using 36 per minute. Okay, let's do this. So 36 there, and then you're 40. Oh no, because you're slugged out. So we're using exactly 60. So I probably actually don't need a level 2 belt there, but whatever. And we should have tons in here. Yeah, okay. We're not going to run a or, um, Kateria Mingus anytime soon. That's good. Cool. So this is all being made now, right? You guys are making stuff for me? You're not. Because these are just filling up? Yeah. I think once those fill up, we'll be good. One, two. Wait. Wait, something's wrong. I screwed this up. <laughs> okay. There we go. That's how that needs to go. Much better. Yeah, because you're doing five for copper and you are not. Here, have that one. Okay. And you guys are making rods? You are? I'm going to take those if you don't mind. Cool. Looking pretty nice. So. Now, let's get down to the serious business, which is these things. The serious business is going to look like this. We're going to bring our fuel, or our uranium, our refined uranium, up through here. So let's get that set up. This is going to be on level 2. Um, so. Level 2. There's only 3 inputs for these, right? Oh, I didn't actually build these yet. Yeah, there's only 3 inputs, so that's good. Oh, I gotta get my uh, encased beams over here too. I forgot about that. Those might be coming through the center hole over here. The center hole which doesn't exist yet. But they might come up through here. Okay. So. There's three inputs. One's at ground floor. Let's do one at a time. And I am actually going to use... Oh, wait, shoot. These need to be three high. I'm going to use these as spacers. Okay. And I believe we are making a lot of these. Yeah, 200. So these are going to be Mark III builds. Oh, I'm doing this wrong. I'm doing this the hard way. Why are we doing things the hard way? There we go. That's the easy way. Uh, actually, 
so we don't actually need to do that like that. We can just do it like that. Here's my inputs. Okay. I'm gonna use Mark Three because I'm. No, well, I'm not really getting that short on plates. I thought I was getting a shorter on iron plates, but I'm not actually. Okay. So there we go. Did I not plug you in? No, I didn't. Um, we'll, we'll bring that uranium up here now. Those uranium pellets. Might as well. So that is going to look like this. <laughs> Auto saves keep getting longer and longer. Okay. It's going to look like that. Um, yeah, that's centered enough. It's not quite centered, but whatever. So, give me a Mark III lift. We can plop this guy right here. Where? Right there? Let's go right there. And we will put a merger on it. And here are our outputs. 25 per minute, 25, 50, 75, 100, 125. So this is also Mark III belts. Now, how tall are you? You are here. How tall is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven, right? Seven looks correct. I'm resisting the urge to count out loud. It's very hard. Seven, okay. And seven. Okay. So give me some mergers. Let's check our power too. I'm so afraid we're going to tank our power trying to get all this set up and running. Consumption. We're getting very close. We're not using our batteries. We're about 5,000 megawatts. It's a 5,000 megawatt buffer, which is pretty good. I will say that is pretty okay. so many of these things. I think it's eyeball seven. That's about seven. Yeah. I can eyeball this. And they're far enough apart that if I don't eyeball it correctly, I can... They can just be adjusted. It's fine. They can be a little bumpy. What are we doing for time? If we're quick, we might actually be able to get our uranium fuel set up here in this episode. We got five minutes. It's going to be tight, but we might be able to. We got our fuel going already. 
Why don't we get our... Uh, control rod's going. So you are a merger. I want a splitter. Just out of curiosity, can I cram? I can. It's tight. Will that work? I think that'll work. Oh wait, hold on. This is gonna go like this. Um, splitter. Like so. Can this belt make this corner? No, it can't. Okay, so let's reconvene here. How are we gonna do this? If I put a splitter here for you... that work? Let's find out. Hmm. Yes. The answer is yes it will. Cool. Am I putting seriously putting mergers on all these? Okay. Control rods go. Okay, cool. We are doing pretty okay. The last thing we're going to need is encased beams, and we don't need a heck of a lot of these either. Hmm. Yeah, I'll be fine. I was concerned about this overlap here, but there's not much I can do about it, unfortunately. Two. Come on, get in there. Get in there. And these are in case beams. Oh, we got two minutes. I think we can do it. I think we can do it. We got two minutes. If this thing attaches, we can do it. There we go. Okay. We can do it. We can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Believe in yourself. Okay. In case beams. Nope, stop. I in case beams. Um, they're going to be in the middle here, so I think something like that, something like this, alright, alright, get rid of this pole, oh, this belt is in a weird, it's got a weird blump. Why do you have a weird blump? No. Okay, that's fine. We can we can figure that out later on. Maybe in between episodes, I'll figure it out. We got 15 seconds. We're not gonna make it. <laughs> so we're gonna go a little overboard because we are five seconds away, but we're so close. They're right here.
Uh, there? I think. Yep. And... 20 seconds over time. Perfect. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. I really hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please give us a like and subscribe. It helps us out a lot. We will see you next time. Cheers.